Teams allows you to share documents with groups of people. Documents shared to a team can be filtered by the team, making it easier to find and organize. Teams also allows you to share groups of people to several documents and folders instead of individually adding each user. This means updating who has access is as easy as changing the team members. When you create or are added to a team, the team appears under the Teams filter on the left side of the Documents page. Click on Teams to show all the teams you are a part of, then select one of the teams to show the documents that are shared specifically with that team. The permissions given to the team are inherited by all individuals that are a part of that team. You can organize documents by teams based on roles, view, and share permissions. If you need to add someone to a set of documents shared with the team, you can simply add them to the team itself instead of sharing them into each individual document. This makes it easier for the creator to manage shares to multiple documents by simply adding individuals to existing teams instead of granularly adding the individual to each document. Also, editing the share permissions for the team updates the share permissions to all team members, making it easy to change the level of access to all users in the team. Teams allows you to filter for documents shared to those teams. Teams also allows you to organize and control the level of share permissions to groups of people instead of individually changing them for each individual. Teams provide another method to keep documents organized throughout your company, and a technique to easily share documents and folders with several individuals.